Today what I'm doing is trying to figure out how I'm going to use my leftover phylon for the inside layer of phylon on the trailer. I have two big pieces. This one is approximately 17 foot 6 inches long and 28 inches wide. As you can see, it doesn't make it all the way around. But that's okay, I knew it wouldn't anyway. Now the buck is all completed. You can see this little hole here, but that doesn't really affect anything. Unfortunately, the buck isn't perfect. It's about 3 16 of an inch on this side from being square all the way around. Since I'm just working with hand tools, it's probably as good as I can expect. But you can see that the shape is all there. Corners came out really nice, I think. At any rate, I will be using all of this phylon. I have one big piece left over. This piece is 104 inches by, uh, I think, 73. This phylon is gray. I'm not too worried about piecing together the inside. The strength is mostly going to be on the wrap on the outside. I think, anyway. <laughs> I could be wrong. But I'm probably going to use the single big sheet because it will go from about here all the way around the roof and it will reach somewhere about here. That way, when you're in the trailer, most of the exposed part will be all one big piece. So that's what I'm shooting for right now. And then I will take this wrap off and piece it together to do the rest of the trailer which is going to be the exposed floor and the exposed roof when it's done. I'm going to make up a jig to cut the slots in the foam. That'll come later, because this weekend, uh, going away for the weekend, so the work is gonna come to a grinding halt. Uh, as far as the weight of the buck goes, I can turn it over myself. It's not light, but this is the idea. All the weight is going to be in the structure to make the trailer, not in the trailer. I'm hoping this trailer, including the frame, should only be about 600 pounds. And with the height of it and I believe it has a fairly nice rounded profile. I think it should uh, tow behind just about anything. All right, that's it for today. Thanks for watching.